Tired of text grouping that fails? Here is a pivot table secret to fix it. I want to create a report that shows the shifts for each name on each date. I create a pivot table. I go to the insert tab, table, pivot table in the existing worksheet. I select a destination. I hit OK. I drag the name to the rows. I drag the date to the columns and I drag the shift to the values. Unfortunately, I just get number one for each date. Then let's delete this pivot table. I start over again. I go to the insert tab, table, pivot table. I want to create it in the existing worksheet and I check this box, add this data to the data model. I drag the name to the rows. I drag the date to the columns. And now before dragging the shift, I go to the power pivot tab, the data model. I click on measure, new measure. I'll be naming my new measure all shifts and I create a concatenate X function. It uses the table shifts and the field name shift. I hit OK. And now let's go to the design tab and delete the grand total. I get the report that I was looking for. Want more pivot table tips? Check out other videos in this series and don't forget to like and subscribe.